This shit about to be gas. I'm just gonna say it right now, Naruto versus Neji is the most badass fight in Naruto. And yes, of course, you could argue that Naruto versus Sasuke was the best fight of Naruto. But something about Naruto getting his get back for somebody that he doesn't even know sits perfectly right with me. Not only did he get his get back, he embarrassed this nigga. Like, I can honestly barely put into words just how amazing this fight was. And just to show you guys how amazing this battle was, let's get into the fight breakdown. You got anything to say to me? Say something cool! Say something cool! What the hell was that? Only what I told you the last time! This one was for my one true love! Sasuke! Inara! Inara! I don't know about you guys, but when Naruto announced that it was up for Neji the next time he sees him, I couldn't wait to see the next episode. Like, Naruto before the Talk No Jutsu was a different Naruto. The only thing that mattered to him was making sure that he ran his bones with you. Here we go! Here comes Naruto with the Kunai distraction, but Neji's defense is too perfect! Naruto on the offensive! Neji with a gentle fist! Now Naruto is fully aware that Neji loves close combat, but to really understand how much he loves close combat, he has to get in there to figure it out himself. Okay, Neji with the lean? You see me? I see you! I'm about to end this man's whole career. Neji, no! Neji, yes! Ah! <laughs> Neji pushed this nigga so hard he turned into Yamcha! <sighs> You broke my fucking rib! Then I guess we're having barbecue. Oh my god, nigga, stop! Your jokes are ass! You have no way of beating me. Beat you? No. I wanna kill you. Cut! Uh, Naruto, your line is believe it. You have three lines. Believe it, Shadow Clone Jutsu, and Sasuke. That is all we can pay you. What about Rasengan? We can talk about Rasengans after the next season. Fine, I use Shadow Clone. What the fuck? This nigga throwing crip? <sighs> Shadow Clone Jutsu! Welcome to the show for you. We've been choking your ass. Long dick style. At this point, I thought Naruto was really about to put this nigga Neji six feet under. But I was wondering, why did that nigga just use the multi Shadow Clone Jutsu? Like, I think that'd been like plenty of, enough to like beat his ass, right? I think it was be jump force, not jump fiesta. What the fuck? Ah, I got him. Why did Neji give a dual wheel double fist noogie into a front flip? To crotch shot the audience! Whoa, I can't let you get close! As beautiful of a shot this is, what is this nigga doing in the back? Stop dragging your feet and get in the mix! At this point, Neji is over Naruto and his ninja buddies. And for Neji to show you how completely and utterly useless Naruto's clones are, he gives these two the double guap guap and wombo combo. See how he crushed the clone Naruto's head into the ground? Clone or not, Neji is a villain! Send that nigga to jail and throw away the key! It's completely disrespectful this to guy. watch your op disgracefully crush your clones! Now Naruto's like, well, if five didn't work, let's together. try a hundred! Shadow Clone Jutsu! Somebody, Somebody put this man on a t-shirt! Now I've seen what a bunch of Shadow Clones can do to Mizuki, but I did not know what they were gonna do to fucking Neji. This nigga Neji fed him the hand no jutsu. This is child abuse! Somebody please put Naruto out of his misery! To see a nigga handle all your clones with no sweat, no effort, just leave John. Look at it, he's flying through niggas! He knows which one is the real Naruto! He's smiling at niggas! Neji said I skipped the filler, I know which one is you, Naruto! <laughs> Got this nigga shook. When I tell you I was just as confused as Naruto, I'm like, this nigga has chakra shields? Where the fuck did you get those from? All I know is Principal Perry was earning her teeth with this episode. This nigga has dropped at least 200 clones. At this point, he's fucking spamming. At this point in the show, Neji has been over Naruto since the beginning. This nigga's dropping ultimate wombo combos on this nigga. He's sending him to the Shadow Realm! It's literally gonna take like a million mommy kisses to make his upper body feel better. Like, Neji, come on, this is a child. A literal child that you're trying to beat the shit out of. Hey, yo, big ma. Yo, what's good, gang? Pass me the ox. 
So this is missing for the footage, but Neji cut off all of Naruto's chakra network, which would have gave Naruto a massive L. But since Naruto has both the Nine Tails and his chakra, he's about to give Neji the fight of his fucking life. Oh hell no, this shit's rigged! Why is this nigga Naruto shaking like a fucking stripper? This scene alone had me so fucking hyped because Neji's finally about to get his ass whooped after talking all that shit about destiny, about how Naruto's not gonna be shit. Naruto said, okay, hold this for me. Rotation! See, now it's fine that they included Shino in this shot right here, but could they at least have pulled the nigga's fucking jacket down? Like, I wanted to see what the fuck he's feeling. This nigga has been stone cold for like the past 30 episodes. <laughs> I'm alive! I'm alive! Oh my god! Oh my god, what the fuck was that? <laughs> you ain't nothing but a bitch. You always be a bitch. Would you just shut the hell up already? Damn. He really about to rock my shit. Now, keep Sasuke's name out of your fucking mouth! The winner is Naruto Uzumaki. And that is the end of the fight breakdown. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you leave a like and comment in the comment section below. Let me know what you want to see next. My schedule is super crazy right now. So uploads are going to be now Wednesdays and Saturdays for the time being. But again, I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you guys later.